Hi guys, Javier Antunes here from Tattoo Theory with another Tattoo Theory Tuesdays. Today's tip I want to talk about about needles. Basically, there's a cool little trick that some people already know and some people don't. This is more kind of like a overall awareness to the little trick. It does help everybody out. So with some of the mags especially, what happens is sometimes they come out a little bit spread, which is perfectly fine for certain techniques. That's the reason why they do it. As far as like color packing, shading, stuff like that, you do want it a little bit spread. But sometimes if you want like that much tighter control, there's kind of an easy way to do it um, that you can pretty much do to any mag, any kind of needle, you know, grouping and stuff like that. It's uh, really simple. All you have to really do is just pop off the plastic piece, which is nice and simple. Once you have it off, you push on the back end to get it nice and out. And then with your index finger resting on the bottom of it and your other index finger resting on the top of it, you just kind of push down a little bit in between. So what ends up happening is you end up getting this little bit of a bend to the tip of it. Now what's kind of cool about that is once you put on the plastic piece all together, like so, if you look, now it's a little bit tighter. So let's say, for example, you want to go into a much tighter corner, into some shading and stuff like that. It's really easy to do so. Barely an inconvenience at all. Also, a little trick too is, is don't be afraid to use a corner of mags. Sometimes a corner of a mag, let's say like a straight mag or even a curved mag, you can get into really nice tight corners where you don't really have to rely so heavily on like a liner and stuff like that. Now, same thing goes with a liner. With a liner, you can definitely kind of go into those tips and corners a little bit easier as well. You know, it's one of those type of things where if you don't feel like switching over back and forth, there's little tricks you can kind of do by kind of tilting onto the corner and stuff like that. It kind of veer away from having to constantly switch back and forth like crazy. And that's our Tattoo Theory tip for Tuesdays. You can definitely check out the needles on darklab.com. And if you guys have any other questions, make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and we'll get back to you next time.